All right, this is a quick getting started video for Jobbot. So before we start, we have like three main use cases for Jobbot. The first one is general document editing. The second one is generating these documents. And then the third one is about notes. So I'm gonna break this video up into three different sections and you can go in between the ones you want at the bottom. So I'm gonna go over generations first. So I'm gonna click this button and then you see a whole bunch of stuff here. The first thing I'm gonna do is go over on the right to train Jotbot. Um, and so what I can do is I can copy an essay that I've written before, go over here, create a training set, and I can paste it in and click start training. And so what Jotbot has done is it's, it's read all of your writing, analyzed how you write, and it's gonna give you some insights on, on what makes your writing unique. And so when I submit this here, it's going to use this to create any feature rating from a generation and try to make it sound like you. Okay, the next thing is sources. So I can go over here um, and I can click add sources. So I have a, a research paper, a journal right here, an article, and you have the options between uploading a PDF, pasting text, or a link. So I'm gonna paste the link in here and it's gonna pull the, the text from the website and then it's gonna add it in. Okay, it just added it in. Um, and so now on the main part of the screen, it's it's now asking you, what are you writing? So I can type out a prompt like, write a research paper. And then the cool thing I can do is if I type at, it lets me include these sources in the generation. So I can just click here and boom. Um, and if you have any ideas, you can click that here. You can increase the paragraph count. Um, all right, let's say eight. And then we can click Start Jotbot. So the first thing it's going to do is it's going to give you a, a bunch of ideas to choose from. It'll pop up here any second. Yeah. Um, let me pick the first one. And then we're going to click Continue and go into the outline. OK, cool. Now we've got the outline. Um, an important thing to note here is that each of these headings corresponds to one paragraph in the final generation. OK. And now we're going to, you can also edit this to adjust how the generation looks, but we're just gonna click continue. Okay, now we've got the, the final paper that Jotbot wrote for us. Um, it includes some references at the bottom. And yeah, so now we have a whole bunch of additional general document features we can use. One thing we can do is we can highlight a chunk of text and then give Jotbot instructions. So we can say, make this shorter. And Jotbot has context of your entire document so, for example, you can say, write a conclusion, and it's going to use the entire thing. So we can replace the text here. Um, another thing is, if you're unsure of what to write, or you need just to complete a paragraph or something, you can type plus plus, and Jotbot is just going to start writing either the next paragraph or the next sentence for you. Um, looking over here on the right, there's a couple features. So the first one is chat. So you can tell you can you can interact with your document here so i can say summarize and it's gonna it's gonna read this entire doc and then summarize and give me some key points um there's a lot of things you can do with this but i'll, I'll leave it at that okay now we're going to move on to um, the next feature which is notes so we can go back to the home page by clicking job up here and then we can click blank document um, and if you go on, onto this right sidebar and navigate to notes you have a couple options. So the first one is transcription. So it's gonna use your mic and it's gonna transcribe exactly what it's hearing. And then every so often, like every minute or so, it's gonna turn what it's heard into notes and start streaming it right there. This is pretty useful for like Zoom calls or, or lectures in person, stuff like that. But yeah. Okay, the next thing is taking videos and turning them into notes. So we can go back to the homepage um, and we can click this notes button. You can also get there via the blank document. Um, and then we're gonna take a YouTube video. So this is like an hour and 40 minute lecture. And if we paste the link in here and then pick our desired language and click submit, it's going to pull the transcript right here. And then it's gonna give you a bunch of detailed notes on this whole thing. Um, and yeah, and you can also chat with these notes and turn them into an essay or whatever you like. So yeah, that's the general overview of Jotbot, and if you have any questions or concerns, 
join our Discord by clicking this button, and we'll get back to you. Bye.